New at four, an outpouring of support today for the family of the Worcester firefighter who died a hero on Wednesday. A foundation out of New York created in the wake of 9-11 traveled to Worcester to make a very emotional announcement. Western Mass News reporter Alyssa McCann was there. The Worcester community and Menard family are still picking up the pieces after the death of Lieutenant Jason Menard, who died saving his fellow firefighters in an intense fire Wednesday and is now being remembered as a hero. The Worcester Fire Department and actually the fire service in general has lost a, a great firefighter, a good man, um, a great fire officer, but that pales in comparison to what the family has lost. But out of the ashes comes a light of positivity. Firefighters from the New York City Fire Department and the Stephen Siller Tunnel to Towers Foundation, named after a New York City firefighter who lost his life on 9-11, announced the organization has put $100,000 toward paying off the Menard family's mortgage, taking the financial burden off Menard's wife, Tina, and their three young children. When you heard the courage that he was willing to go back in and risk his life to save another, because there is no greater act of love than to give your life for another human being. And it is exactly, exactly what Lieutenant Menard did. The Tunnel to Towers Foundation knows all too well about tragedies, but also heroes. This started because Stephen Siller, Siller lived his life under the teachings of St. Francis of Assisi, that, that when there is an opportunity, do some good. And that's exactly what this organization does. Tunnels to Towers is giving $100,000 towards the Menards mortgage, but also they need your help. They're asking everyone out there to donate $11 to the Menard family to help pay off their mortgage by Christmas. The foundation is dedicated to helping out Gold Star families and families of fallen first responders, including fallen Weymouth Police Sergeant Michael Chesna's wife and their children. Unfortunately, I know the pain you are feeling because 16 months ago today, it was me and my family suffering this unimaginable loss. For Western Mass News, I'm Alyssa McCann.